Hey, my friends, jumping right into the new home free. Yes, we are. We're going to check out Cruisin'. Or Cruise, I should say. Yeah, Cruise. All right. Um, well, people told me they were coming out with it. Here we are. And let's jump in. Baby, you a song. Oh, I gotta stop. I just gotta stop it right here. Look at this van. Old Ford van. Nice. Those vans, guys, were just like practically indestructible. My brother had one. You had the, the engine between you and the passenger. You could like take that piece off. What a what a great start to this, guys. Super cool. I love retro stuff. It, it just I don't know. Oh, it was all built better. You know, we didn't have all these stupid computers. Uh, you go in there and you touch the wrong thing. And you fry your computer. I hate that stuff. I really, really hate it. Yes, I have a, a modern car, like a a 2020, I think mine's a 2022. Um, and I hate all that stuff, but retro stuff, huge money now. You try to buy a van like that all fixed up and stuff, you're probably talking 50, 60 grand. So, you know, bad enough I had to pay like 30 grand for my car. So, I don't know. Baby, you a song, you it. make me want to roll my windows down and cruise. I got my windows down and the radio up, get your radio up. Yeah, when I first saw it, bikini top on her, she's popping right out of the South Georgia water. Thought, oh, good Lord, she had them long tan legs, couldn't help myself, so I walked up and said, Baby, you a song, you make me want to roll my Say, let me find that spot. I gotta say, I think I take the van over that pickup truck. Uh, I tried out some pickup trucks and they just did not ride comfortable. They just rode like tanks. Tanks. I'm like, come on, man. These are brand new trucks. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it was a suspension or what, but a uh, salesman was trying to sell me one. Uh, and I was like, yeah, no. Uh, instead, I bought a Camaro. What can I say? I'm a guy. True story. Absolutely true story. Uh, I have a 2021 uh, Camaro. It's just a six cylinder, but it's the, uh, the the rally sport one. Pretty cool car. Super fast, too. Right up into the cab of my truck and said, fire it up, let's go get this thing stuck. Baby, you a song, you make me want to roll my windows down.
Although you wouldn't catch me on one of those little electric scooter things because hell no. No way, man. I tell you why. Um, true story. Um, <laughs> in 2019, my son and I were riding hoverboards. Going a little bit too fast. Just barely nicked a, a little bench we had. Uh, we had benches for our dining room table. Went flying. Fractured my hip. I had three screws in my hip. Titanium screws. True story. No way. Getting on that stuff would be a major anxiety thing. However, super cool song. Um, it's always fun. Uh, you know, Humphrey, I don't know. Like I say, I love that band. I, and when Austin smiles, I just can't get over the fact um, how he can, like, really convey his emotions. He just has this the slightest of smile uh, that just gives you goosebumps. I don't know. It, it's really cool. I love it. Uh, anyway... Code word. Uh, how about Zagnut Bar? Who knows what they are? Do you guys remember the Zagnut Bars? Peanut butter, um, crunchy, uh, kind of hard to find now. I don't remember the last time I had a Zagnut Bar. Um, a long, long time ago. Anyway, super cool in this, guys. Um, I love that. I really love that band. So that was nice to have that all restored. Uh, the only problem with them is they're like monstrously top heavy. Because my brother got out of the army, he came home, and it was the day of my uh, my other brother's graduation that he got home in the morning, and I guess my brother thought it would be cool, I'll bring him, and they went around a really sharp corner, really, really too fast, top heavy van didn't make the corner, that was the end of that van until we chopped off the top, and we just used it like as a backwoods buggy, uh, true story guys, I'm, <laughs> I'm telling you, we used to haul wood in it, you know, do stuff like that, but great vans but super top heavy all right guys have a great weekend i am off to the grocery store so that should be fun i always wait until like seven or eight o'clock before i go because well i just don't like to be in a crowded place so anyway have a great weekend guys